Let's do him. He's done like real TV. All right, I love these graphics. And by graphics, I mean uh, fortune cookie stuff. It's AWA 2000. That guy's name is AWA 2000. R U R 2000. Okay. Ron Head does look like Maddie in the house. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm not sorry. AWA always wiping ass. So R2R 2000. All right. I believe this gentleman, I didn't catch his name. Uh, I believe he was over in the States with Osamu Nishimura. All right, so yeah, Tecmo, this is a legit New Japan young boy that ended up doing MMA. So this show's already fucking weird. We have, like, what appears to be a backyard wrestler against a dude that was trained in the New Japan dojo. Holy shit, this guy's good. How big is his dick if that was a low blow? I would love to be able to see the show. Yeah, there you go, hard cam guy. Makoto Murioka. Okay. Did they say he was from Russia? Ron Head kind of sounds like uh, Stephen Prezak. I do believe there is a floor cam, so it's not just the the one tripod camera. Yes, shoot style versus robot style. I love this. Hey, Incident 73, I hope you're doing well as well. Yes, this ring is huge. Also, these men are very small. But yes, this ring is gigantic. El Hio del Santo Gold. Um, I would not be surprised. Like, there's all sorts of weird, like, SoCal Indie Lucha connections. I would not be surprised if the guy who ran this, uh, Ron Head, J.R. Benson, etc., had, uh, connections. Uh, Jonathan Mayer. There are, there are a lot of well-known guys in this show. I don't want to ruin any of the surprises, though. I think they set up front already. Dan Severn's on this show. And uh, I spoiled it earlier. Osamu Nishimura is on this show, I do believe. Are you R2000? A bit robotic. Get it, guys? Get it? He's a robot? That's Dan Severn. Oh my God! Does he think it's a shoot? Oh, there are just some giant names. Again, I tried to. I, I skimmed through it a bit, um, but I, I didn't like stop to, to spoil myself. But I like to have legitimate reactions when I watch with you guys. Is this the Lost Hack and Schmidt? I don't know if you guys have seen that. Um, it's weird to watch the George Hackenschmidt film that came out last week. The ref's name was Nick, probably. All right. Oh, oh. Now they're kind of shooting. We need to, we need this robot to do shoot style. This is just fascinating to watch. Hey Andrew. Hey, yes, this took place on your eighth birthday. Um, I, I think mine was in August of this year. Yes. You're, you're referee for this match, Nick, probably. Love it. Why? What the fuck, dude? You're supposed to be a silly little robot, and you're doing like hard chops. I think the problem with like California before PWG is just it's so far out of the way of everyone's purview, I guess. Maintaining a rear chin lock, a form of a sleeper hold. However, Moroka reversing it down into a. Listen, these are, guys are not supposed to be minis. It's just that ring is huge. 
Rams uh, appreciate it so far. Hard Irish. Um, if, if somebody could help Josh, that'd be great with the memberships. Uh, I haven't heard of any issues. Well, there we go. Hey, look at that. 1995, somebody respects an armbar enough to know that when you extend the arm, you either tap or you or it gets broken. Holy shit. The one thing I'll tell you, anyone good on this show was flown in. Right, Southern Comfort with J.R. Benson, and it's the Gemini Kid, and Greg Rigolato. I am in love with the graphics. Are the fans, like, arguing with the... Oh, okay, there's J.R. Benson. I thought that fan was just, like, cussing at another fan. Is that Stacy? I believe that might be Stacy Cornette. Oh, gosh. Of course there's stars and bars, guys. Of course. That one guy. The leather jacket. Not, not J.R. Benson, but the leather jacket wrestler. I might like him. Oh, it's Davey Meltzer. I don't know what's up with ads 